love next strength and power I am the embodiment of hate, the personification of evil. No message shall shroud my eyes with the promise of power. Broken bones and shattered thrones will litter my path of chaos. Total destruction. All right, what's up, you guys? So I've already made a video on this in the past, and so I've kind of already predicted uh, that this was going to happen, or I kind of predicted that things were going in this trend. Um, of kind of getting away from women's bodybuilding but now it's kind of official um they've they've replaced the uh the uh miss international competition at the arnold classic with the uh 212 division it's gone so the miss international is now it's, it's completely gone it's not going to be in the arnold classic anymore um as far as i know ever again um that's what i've heard from the people that i know that are involved with the arnold classic that the that the Miss International Women's Bodybuilding will no longer be a part of the Arnold Classic. I mean, that's also what I've heard um, when I made the video in the past. It was about the Olympia. The Olympia is dropping the Miss Olympia competition. Um, so when I heard that news, um, I immediately jumped to the conclusion that what they're trying to do in the IFBB is this push towards you know the Dana Lynn Baileys. Um, these fitness figure physique girls that still have a decent amount of muscle, still have a decent amount of fitness, but are still attractive. They're still ladylike. It's something normal. And I don't really like that, man. Bodybuilding should be bodybuilding. It should stick to the basics. I don't. I never liked the bikini class. I never agreed with that. Um, bikini class, to me, man, I'm sure these girls do diet and they do work hard, but to me... It just seems like a bunch of girls who are super cocky. They got fat asses and big tits, and they get on there, you know, maybe diet down to, I don't know, a full 12% body fat. And really, man, any girl, you know, with a relatively decent body fat percentage is going to look decent in a bikini. So I just never really agreed with the bikini stuff. I always liked women's bodybuilding, man. I thought it was interesting. I thought it was, they look crazy, they look freaky. And that's what brings people to bodybuilding shows. They want to see the craziness, the freakiness, the vascularity, the muscles. You know, I'm not gay, I'm straight, but I'm telling you guys, man, to sit through one of the women's shows where it's, you know, 50 bikini girls, 50 figure girls, 50 physique girls, and they compare them all, and they do their little struts, and man, it takes forever. I would much rather sit through, you know, 10, um, 10 uh, women's bodybuilding competitors, and I, that would be much more interesting to me, and I'd much rather watch that. Um, but I did make this prediction in the past. I do think they are completely phasing out uh, women's bodybuilding from the IFBB period, which is a huge deal. And I'm not seeing anybody making videos on this. I don't know if I'm the only one noticing this or what, but to me, um, it's becoming very evident that they're they're seriously trying to phase this out. Um, that's why they're really pushing men's physique too. I think they're trying to have a, a an acceptable aesthetic aspect to the IFBB, and they want to make that a big part. Um, with social media and you know the general the general population of people that's really getting into it and the general public they want to draw them um, to something that they can participate in that's less freaky that they don't have to take steroids necessarily to compete in um, they want they want to give it like a realistic element that you don't have to be this big freaky bodybuilder to to be a part of the IFBB or be a part of bodybuilding um, and I guess that has its pros and cons, man. I think that has its drawbacks and its advantages. I, but personally, man, I think they should keep the women's bodybuilding. I don't know. Man, let me know in the comment section what you think. But personally, I'm all for keeping women's bodybuilding. I think it's crazy that they're getting rid of it. And I think it's kind of blasphemy uh, to the sport. Because what they started with, man, women's bodybuilding. There was none of this, you know, physique, figure, fitness. I don't really enjoy watching that stuff that much. I'm sure those athletes work hard. Like I said, man, I'm not denying that. But I really, you know, I wish I wish they would stick to the basics. I don't really like men's physique either. Um, if you disagree with me, hey, whatever, it's a free country. But if you agree with me, man, like the video because I think this whole physique figure stuff, it's getting away from what bodybuilding was all about. It was about the big freaks, the best of the best, the biggest of the biggest, the most muscular of the most muscular, the most vascular, the most crazy, the most insane, the top, the peak of human genetic um, possibility and that's what I liked about bodybuilding I don't like all this aesthetic stuff and all this 
uh, I just don't like it. They're trying to appeal to the mainstream, and that's not what bodybuilding's about. Ah, 